Morning guys, dealing with Florida fishing fools. We're out here in Mosquito Lagoon going for some bull redfish. Me and Caitlin took a little trip. It's Labor Day weekend. It's probably gonna be getting kind of crazy over here. Just want to show you a pretty basic setup for what we like to do over here for the bull redfish. So we picked up some blue crabs before we before we left. I'm gonna show you how we prepare these. So you got a live blue crab like this. What you're gonna want to do first pinch his claws right at that knuckle if you can see that and he should just drop he should just drop the claw like that I like to use those for chum I'll just start throwing those out grab his other one struggling here pinch dropped it Next thing you want to do is I, I go with a pair of needle nose pliers. You want to go right into his opening, into his mouth, his filter right there. And you're just going to punch this through. It's kind of like that. Nice quick death for the crab. That gives you an access spot. I just stick my finger in here, put my thumb on the upper side of the shell, and just pull it apart like that. got the, the meat I just come with a fillet knife a lot of people quarter these I like to just go in halves split the shell like that that you got two baits we're fishing pretty moderate current um, typically kind of a slow outgoing tide right now but I like to remove the legs off of there so it's not spinning there in the current twisting your line all up once you have that there I don't like to fish these on light tackle um, typically do you know a medium heavy or a heavy uh, 20 to 30 pound rod the five to eight thousand size spinning reel so you can catch them pretty quickly these fish are going to be starting to spawn here and this is just sport fishing you're not keeping these fish I like to get them in quick and get them released especially with this warmer water okay so that those that that main claw that you put that you dropped off in the very beginning i'm going to enter my hook through there and kind of curl it get it to come up through the bottom half of the shell there and there you go that's a basic bull red blue crab bait rigged up we're just gonna sit them here we sit them in the rod holder and you just wait it's pretty relaxing fishing Caitlin's gonna be laying out and you just wait till you hear that drag go off cast it out there we're kind of sitting on the edge of the channel here nice little drop off we got big snook and tarpon blowing up all over the place so we're definitely going to be wanting to get into that eventually um, the other plan um, we're hoping to if this weather holds up maybe maybe clear the inlet later today and get offshore do some blue water fishing I didn't really anticipate that so getting bait and all that stuff might be interesting over here we kind of got it down back home in Anna Maria but over here I don't really know probably go to a near shore wreck and try to sabiki up some pilchards and see what we can do but all right you guys stay tuned we'll bring some action to you
came for, guys. Awesome fish. breeder red fish like this really any fish you want to make sure you get them a good revival this is the the future stock so we definitely want to take care of these fish in an area that's definitely been damaged by poor water quality and tons of other issues over here in the mosquito lagoon so we definitely want to make sure we're keeping this future stock going strong just like to kind of sit here and let, let them sit in the current for a while until they're strong enough to really kick out of my grip. Oh. There she goes. All right, guys just revived that other fish. I was untangling the line. Other rod went off. Caitlin's got a good one on. How's it feel, baby? Strong. <laughs> <laughs> Been a little while. You didn't get one last time, did you? Good one. <laughs> pretty, pretty tight drag on these guys. We're somewhat close to structure, but redfish really don't run the structure. You usually, don't have to worry. But just try to keep a keep a heavy drag on them to keep the keep the fight short. was it? Tough. Tough? Yeah. Ah, you're only at four minutes. <laughs> Wee! Heck yeah, baby. Great fish. Nice fish, but Caitlin, literally right as I was trying to untangle the, the rig from the previous fish, this one went off. I always fish two rods out of the out of the rod holders, out of the back. In this particular spot, we're fishing on the channel edge right along some docks. I got one, one in with the docks and then one sitting out on the channel. They both went off. Good job, baby. Thank you. 
rocket launch, SpaceX.